All right, we'll be doing a field test of this, uh, this Alpha 100. Alpha man, that's what I'm. Oh look at that! Look, 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 look at that big at money, big money. Oh, that was it. That was my allowance for the year. <laughs> Laptop, I don't Garmin, know how to do it. GoPros. Yep. You, you spin out. It's gone. We just it's, started. It's, it, it's, it, it, it just not even March yet. My tax refund just went. <laughs> gone. Shit, dog. Oh. Zoom map to dogs. It shows that's off. Track manager. Then you can go your dog tracks. The outlaw. You go in there and you want to clear the tracks. Oh, okay. It's starting to hunt, but it still remembers the tracks in there, so it clutters it up. Yeah. So like every second, third hunt, I just go through there and just going clear them every all dog, out. and then your like a current track, you can cut it out. But when you do a new hunt, it should do your current track cleaning that. But like contact. Contact is what this thing tracks. Like I can set it up, I can track you on that, I can right. track him, we can track each other. So know each other, like dogs over here, you hunt a yard from them, you need to walk you know, to the east a little bit. Right. But when you do that, it takes a spot, like you got 20 dogs, you can have 15 dogs and five handhelds in there. So it, it takes a spot, so. What are you doing there? Just adding some, some of our dogs so you can see them. And it's got their number, so that track code is what you're putting in? Yeah, you can do track code or train code. Train code, you can you can correct my own, my dog. But, oh, yeah. I mean, we, we haven't been doing it. We just been doing it. Like, I think I gave Dallas, I gave Chris's Dallas a track, I mean, a train code. That way, if he saw him running a deer, he can knock, knock his butt. And I... All right. Turn some dogs loose. I'm gonna test out this little this little Alpha 100. See how it works. We got quite a few dogs plugged in on it. Go to the map. I'm looking for Jesse. We'll let Jesse go. So right now it says he's 50 yards away. Which there he goes. So I haven't updated every 10 seconds, so. Yep, now he's 30 feet. See some of these other dogs that we have loaded up in here. Oh, Annie. Annie's out running. 90 yards. Yeah, this thing's pretty good. Kind of points me in the right direction. So right now we have, I think five dogs, five or six dogs loaded up in this thing. You load up 20. It's kind of nice when you're hunting with a bunch of different dogs. You can kind of keep track of where they're all at. I was on a, the geocache site last night and downloaded a couple geocaches and threw it on here. Take the girls out sometime later and let them go find some geocaches, which is pretty exciting to know. I know my last Garmin Oregon had a capability to do geocaches. I wasn't too sure about this. I know it's a GPS, but I thought maybe with it being specific for dog hunting that you wouldn't be able to do it, but you can. So if you're into going out and finding little treasures with your kids, this thing's kind of multi-purpose. All right, hopefully we can... Uh, Get on some pigs today and see how this thing works when they're actually treeing or baying. Hmm. Alright, so Jesse and Annie just took off. They're 500 yards northeast of here. Go to the map. See, they went through the swamp. Now they're back up by the road. <coughs> so far, 
pretty impressed. Like, right with her. Like, he ain't just following her. He, he right. Just... Smoke. I know it's hot, but you need to shut up. Maybe he has to go potty. <laughs> when, you're, when you get old, you can't hold it anymore. Learn how to trap over the side like a bulldog. <laughs> wow, they're going deep in the woods now. Are they? Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah. They're way off the dirt road. Yeah, they are. They're way out there. That's good. That would be freaking amazing if them two found one. See? There's a road. Hmm? There's us. Yeah, they're gonna be coming out right through here. Yeah. They keep the way they're going. So it's got Jesse coming back now. 135 yards. Here in a second. There he is. It's nice to be able to track the dog. I'll tell you, I'm impressed with this system. That's pretty nice. Where is he at? He was right over here by these bushes. I'm just impressed that he comes back. That's awesome. I yeah. that he was going to get out there and he was... He was gone. 526. In the same direction? Uh, yeah. Kind of out that way. Jesse couldn't keep up. He's like, whatever, I'm leaving. I don't know of any dog that can keep up with her. Here I've comes Jesse. Look at that. Dog with as much energy as she has. 89 yards and he's about 89 yards. Coming back. Good boy. Right. Mm -hmm. I love it when he's in that mood right there. I know, so that's why. <laughs> happy. Yeah, wagging his tail straight. Come here. Come here. Hey. He's like, yeah, Ray, I got something to do. Come here. <laughs> he's oh. like, I'm done. Good boy, Jesse. You know exactly where to go, huh? Here's a good puppers. Good boy. <laughs> that's awesome. Right back to his house. <laughs>